listening to those cicadas. You can see them all like the Baltimore Oriole. But you can see them flying around. Ron, my friend, said they're locusts, which I guess, I don't, I don't know, are cicadas the locusts? You can see them. It. It's been, what happened is two broods released at the same time, one in the north and one in the south, and because we're in the middle, we got them both, but, so they said it hasn't happened in 221 years, isn't that just crazy? I don't see a lot of shells over here. Well, I, I, I'm saying shells, but I mean when they shed their skin. I bet they're all the way back in there. This one is the one that had 20 locusts. Look at this one. He's been just sitting there. If you look underneath these leaves, can you see the shed? Isn't that crazy? You don't see a whole lot out here today. I guess I must have got most of them that were out here. So this is a timber line on the one side of our house. All the mats are bad. So there's just a few there. Then if you come down here, look at this. This has got to be one big freaking ant hole. Look at this. What the heck is that? What are they eating? Is that? Oh my goodness. I wonder if it's. Well, these babies are supposed to hatch from these cicadas and then they, they go back down in the ground. I wonder if those are babies. I don't know. But I did see along here. Definitely. But it, it's 
still aren't as bad as my neighbor had around her tree. Holy moly. I bet that was like thousands. Okay, I'm done. I'm done looking at the bugs. You can hear in the distance. I'm not sure what that is, but he makes a different sound. Maybe he's the leader of the cicadas, I don't know. You hear it? 